Save the Astronaut is an exhibition that was developed by two of the OMT partners, the University of Hamburg and Bosch. Its goal is to make people aware of the importance of optomechanical technologies in our daily lives, and it therefore targets people from the very young age, like kids, to adults, parents and elderly people as well. Our exhibition consists of three components. Right now you're watching the first part of our exhibit. It is an animated movie that was provided by Bosch and that runs continuously in a loop. It's a very illustrative movie and it explains the application of microelectromechanical accelerometers, their working principle and their subcomponents. We usually display this video in a small monitor next to the main part of the exhibit, the video game, that I will show you later. This is the second part of our exhibit. It is a large poster that shows high-resolution pictures from microelectromechanical accelerometers from Bosch. It is shown in relation to the size of a human hair, so that people can have an idea on how small these devices are, and it also provides further information about these devices. The last part of our exhibit is a video game, and as for every video game, we need a display, a PC, and the steering wheel. Time is short. Once the astronaut moves a bit towards one of the black holes, they will be swallowed. Save them while you can. By the way, black holes bend light beams that come from stars in the background. This is called gravitational lensing and can be observed with large telescopes. Here we compute the bending in real time. Black holes and even pairs of black holes exist in nature. In reality, Pairs come slowly closer and closer, speed up and finally merge to a single black hole. Such a merger produces gravitational waves, which were directly observed for the first time in 2015 by the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory LIGO. In between the black holes, there is a little astronaut that got lost during a spacewalk and will be most likely swallowed by the black holes. So the goal of our visitors is to use the spaceship to pick up the astronaut and bring it safe to Earth, which is not an easy task. Participants can control the spaceship via the steering wheel, and they can, while tilting it up and down and to the left and to the right, try to save the astronaut and bring him back to Earth. This is the steering wheel that connects the components of our exhibition. As you can see, it has a rectangular shape, is made of perspex and clearly shows a microelectromechanical accelerometer inside, which is used to measure the acceleration of the steering wheel. From it, the signals are sent via cables to our controller box that changes the position, speed and orientation of the spacecraft. Obvious to the visitors, our steering wheel is a homemade device. We hope that visitors will realize how easy and feasible it is to build devices like this one with commercially available accelerometers. <laughs>